mean, I'm, I'm going to tell you what. This is probably the best assignment I've had in a while. I get to be on Lake Natoma. It's finally sunny, Mother Nature. Thank you for that. And we've got the Capital Crew rowing team here. We've got the ladies and the men today. And these are all high schools from all over the region. They all come here and they practice together and then they compete together. And this is really impressive because these athletes are ranked the number one in the region for both the women and the men's side. We've got Casey, who is a coxswain. And I learned last half hour that's the person who's basically forward facing in the boat, right, Casey? Tell everyone yeah. what you do. So basically, we're facing forward so we can see like we're the eyes of the boat, and we have a rudder so we steer the boat, make sure we're going straight down the lanes. Um, you can make calls, so you make moves during races, trying to like get in the lead or stay in the lead. Um, very technical too. You need to know yeah. all the technical aspects to be able to spot what's going on with each rower's body. Absolutely. By the way, Casey's a senior at what high school? Bella Vista. And what college are you going to? Oregon State. Oh, oh, I'm just kidding. I'm just Oregon kidding. I'm an Oregon State. Dad, but you know what? High five, my friend. <laughs> I'm proud of you because this woman also is not only the coxswain on one of these impressive boats, but you also do it for all the men, right? Yes. Yes. Ladies roll. Also, Sophie out there. Wave hi, Sophie. Okay, Sophie, where is Sophie going to college as well? Oregon State as well. And you go to Ponderosa High School, correct? Okay, wonderful. So she is one of the women's team rowers here, of course. We have the crew members from both the ladies and the men's team. All right, I want to talk to you, though, Heist, because this is, uh, is going to be a really wonderful opportunity for us to see these rowers in action. What's going to happen right now? I get to kind of start them off. Yeah, Dina's going to call the start. So a race is 2,000 meters in the spring. All the boats are at a standstill, and all boats have to try to get the line as quickly as possible. They shift into the race cadence, and then it's who can get their bow bow in front and cross the finish line in front. Okay, and then what do I have to say again? You're going to say, capital, sit ready, attention, go. Okay, are you all ready for this? I get to use the megaphone. Oh, you know, my gosh. Don't Dangerous. I don't know why he says that. I don't understand why. I don't know where that comes from. Okay, so capital, sit ready, attention, go. I think I got this. And then I just press this button right here. Is that right? This uh, one? Yep, you hold that down. Let's, let's make sure it's on. Okay, make sure it's on. I do have I do have a voice that carries, I've been told. Okay, <laughs> yeah. Dave Grassoff, are you ready? Yeah. My photographer. Okay. Let's do this. Capital, sit ready. Attention. Go. Yes, I did it. I did it. I think I did okay. Did I do okay, Casey? Yeah, you yeah. did great. <laughs> okay, real quickly, as we're still on this shot, just talk about the energy you got to use to get through a, a team like this, a sport like this. I'm sure it's not easy. Um, no. So a lot of about coxing is your tone when you're speaking. So when you listen or when you watch a rowing race, you'll hear the coxswains. It'll sound like they're screaming, but they're just they're using their tone to get the crew like amped up and ready to go. And it's kind of like the way you speak is the way they're going to feel. So if you're kind of talking like lackadaisically, they're not going to be going very hard. But right. if you use your tone to get excited, then they're going to want to go harder. They're going to want to go harder. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. It's so awesome. Well, thank you so much to the Capital Crew Rowing Team for letting us come out today. And again, one more time, when is the regional coming up in May? That's the first weekend of May here at Lake Natoma. All right. Come check them out and cheer on all these high school students from around the region, guys. Amazing team. Back yeah. to you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Good luck in May. <laughs> I'm telling you, Lake Natoma.